In this week's class, we'll consider the process used to design a class, a process normally referred to as instructional design. Over the past couple of decades, several different methods have been proposed to help trainers design effective classes, and you may have heard of some of those models, like Assure or ARCS. However, one of the simplest and most commonly used is the ADDIE model, and that is what we'll use in this class. ADDI is a five-step process, analysis, design, development, implementation, and evaluation. Each of those steps includes certain requirements, and when they are completed, your class will be well-designed and ready to teach. The analysis step is where you will analyze your training requirement, the audience, the environment, and other factors that will affect your training. This is also where you'll create SMART objectives using the major model. The decision step is where you will use brainstorming, perhaps with a colleague, to find the best way to help your students meet the objectives of the class. There are a dozen different decisions to make, from as simple as the seating arrangement in the room to as complex as what activities your students will complete. The develop step is where you will develop all activities, materials, and other facets of the training experience. This is also the phase where assistant trainers will be trained, students will be registered, and things like travel arrangements will be made. The implementation step is where training will actually occur. This step starts with the beginning of the class and ends with the end of the class. This is when all the prior planning work finally pays off and is probably the easiest and most fun of the steps. The evaluation step is where you determine if the training was effective. You could do that by using tools like surveys or other feedback forms. You could also think about how many students successfully completed some sort of skills test at the end of your training. These would all give you a clue about the effect effectiveness of your class. This week, you'll be required to submit an assignment where you will complete an ADDI worksheet for a hypothetical class that you are going to teach. If you've never completed an ADDIE worksheet before, it will seem very tedious to you. However, those of us who regularly use ADDIE will tell you that in the long run, planning with ADDIE will save you a world of time and make your training much more effective. Let's get started. Mm -hmm.